Weeks ago, we told you how the city of Fairhope has seen an increase of gun thefts from unlocked cars. Now, another city in Baldwin County is telling its residents to lock up. News 5's Mary Smith joins us now live in Gulf Shores tonight to tell us about a social media campaign the city's police department is taking part in. Mary? Roseanne, it's well after 9 o'clock at this point, which means it's time to lock your car and lock your home. Last week, Gulf Shores Police Department took to Facebook and Twitter telling people to lock it or lose it. Gulf Shores Police say when the clock strikes 9, lock your car, your home, and secure your belongings. It's taking to social media with the hashtag 9 p.m. routine to remind residents to lock it or lose it after thefts from cars remain steady. As of November 11th, police received 91 reports of thefts from vehicles, which is right on track with 2016's number of 118 reports. And to date, eight guns have been stolen, six of those from cars. While police say some of them have been recovered, residents say the thought of the others on the streets is scary. They're not going to do anything good with it. It's going to be used for something that's illegal. We do have guns, and we wouldn't want those stolen to be used for something like that either. Another resident and business owner says he's taking no chances. Every night, make sure I lock up my house, lock up my car, um, anything that I think that could be taken, make sure it's stored away. And the Gulf Shores Police Department did get the idea to post about this on social media from the Pasco County, Florida Sheriff's Department. They say since that department started this social media campaign about a year ago, they've seen a 37% decrease in thefts from unlocked vehicles. Reporting live in Gulf Shores, Mary Smith, News 5.